So, right now at school, I'm in this class called Exploring Visual Arts. Now, what you do in this class is you do different um, visually interesting things. Um, right now we are working on Notan, which is, um, I believe he said it was some Japanese, a, a Japanese um, paper cutting technique, just like, it, like origami's a Japanese um, folding paper technique. This is um, Japanese cutting paper, paper cutting technique or whatever. Um, and then we just wrapped up a Zentangle project that went terrible for me um, because I cannot draw. I absolutely suck at drawing, but if you go and you give me a camera, I will give you an entire beautiful masterpiece within 10 seconds or less. I know that I can do it. That is something that I am good at. Photography is my strongest point. That is why next year I am taking photo one, and then my junior year I will take photo two. But, I knew where he was going with this. Shit. Yeah. But. And I love photography so much because I just feel like you have way more options um, with photography versus like drawing or anything like that. Photography, you have way more options and you can edit it to the fullest extent that you want it to be. And it's visually, I, I don't know, it's just like when I'm doing other art projects that aren't photography based, I don't feel anything. But photography makes me feel joy, it makes me feel happy, it makes me feel safe, it makes me feel comforted. Like YouTube videos, no, it's not okay. Like YouTube videos, they make me feel, when I'm filming, I feel at my best. I am probably at my best when I'm filming. Except for those depressing ones, um, like the 13 Reasons Why rant, or I believe this other video was titled to talk about bullying or something like that. Those ones are my more serious ones. These, these types of videos, I do like to keep my channel um, and my content to be very happy and lighthearted, but sometimes you just can't get around the happiness and lightheartedness because Life isn't always going to be happy and joyous and lighthearted. You're going to have downfalls. And that's just the way that life is. So, let's get on to seeing my photos. Okay, so once again, these photos that are you that you are about to see, they do contain um, a bunch of blood, and it's fake blood, but they it, they do contain a bunch of blood. And again, in these photos that I'm in, I, there are huge slits going down my wrists. Um, so just be mindful of that. If you don't like that stuff, that is perfectly fine. Just be mindful of that, click off. Um, this is my warning to you. Viewer discretion is advised. Otherwise, see you guys in the, in, uh, uh, in the outro. Wow.
video. Make sure if you did enjoy it to give it a big thumbs up. Make sure if you are or are not, make sure if you're not subscribed to subscribe by hitting that little subscribe button down there or when the end card pops up by hitting that little circle over here. <clears throat> make sure to have my post notifications on if you are or if you are not subscribed. If you're not subscribed, you should probably subscribe and then turn on those post notifications. <laughs> And then make sure to comment done and hashtag notification squad and you can be my my next notification shout out. Make sure to check out my last video if you don't remember. If, if you haven't seen that video, make sure to go check it out. I talk about the different um, the difficulties of being a YouTuber and yeah, I'll see you guys later. Peace.